guys welcome back to my channel today's video i want to show you guys how to make dry okra dry okra is a very simple recipe and it's very nice very simple and it's very very nice for swallow like wheat and it's one of my best favorite soup so guys let's jump into this video so i'm having two pieces of dry fish and goat meat i've already parboiled and steamed it together this is my local beans we call it okay without this okay your dry soup is not complete so i'm having grinding pepper crayfish and my mangi seasoning and you can see the dry okra you can also use dry okra with ogbono you can mix it the way we mix uh, normal okra and Ogbono. So you can also mix your dry okra and ogbono together. So let's start. It's very simple recipe. So now I'm going to add my, the goat meat here with the stock. This is goat meat and the stock. Then I'll add additional water. Then you add your pepper. The quantity you want. I love pepper so much. So I'm going to add it. Then I'm going to add crayfish. Now I'm going to pound my local beans, my local beans rather. We call it okay in my language. So, I see the way I pound it. So I'm going to add it now. So let's put it on the fire. So guys, it's on fire now. So let's wait. Let the water start boiling. So guys, it's already boiling. Let me add the dry fish. So I'm adding dry fish now. It's a very simple soup and it's nice. Now that the, the everything is boiling, let's do the pounding. Me, I prefer this one. This one is my mother's one, so I normally pan it by myself like this. But when you want to get it from the market, it's already blended. So I used to find it, I have it like this in my house. So guys, after panning is look how it looked like. So it's a very nice soup. So guys, I'm going to add salt. It's time to add a little salt. I don't like salt, just little. So I'm going to add the dry okra. Now you can see it. You can see how it's looking like. So let's start. So I'm adding the brandy uh, dry okra. So if you want to add red oil, it's optional. Me, I like, I prefer white like this. So guys, can see how it's looking nice. If I type that it drop, this is very nice for pounded yam. You know I'm from Germany, so we love pounded yam so much. So it's very nice for pounded yam. I don't want it to look too much thick. So this is okay. So let's wait like five minutes and it's done. It's a very simple recipe. So guys, the soup is ready. Let me even test it. Wow, wow. It's yummy. Let's serve. You can see, let's serve. It's very nice. I'm using goat meat. If you use pandedian amala, everything goes with you. So you can eat it with amala. Pandedian is the best. So guys, you can see how yummy is looking already. It's a very simple recipe and it's very fast. In the next 20 minutes, it's ready. This is one of my best food. So guys, if you love this video, please thumbs up the video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Share my video and drop your comment. See you guys in my next video. I love you all.